has now go to termination of employment due to illness. An employer can terminate an employment due to illness, whether contagious or non-contagious, if, uh, if the continued employment of the employee is prohibited by law or is prejudicial to his health or to the health of his co-employees. And there must be a certification from a competent public health authority that the disease is of such nature or a stage that it cannot be cured within six months, even with proper medical treatment. So medical certificate is a mandatory requirement. The medical certificate should be issued by a competent public health authority, which is a government physician and not by the company doctor. Now, but there are certain illnesses that are not grounds for termination of employment, first of which is HIV infection. Actual, perceived, or suspected HIV infection is not a ground for dismissal from employment. Hepatitis B infection is also not a ground for dismissal from employment. Also, mental health condition is not a valid ground for terminating unemployment unless, unless the condition progresses to such severity that it affects their own safety or the safety of co-workers. And there is a medical certificate by a public health authority with expertise on mental health. Pregnancy-related illness is also not a ground for dismissal because there is a provision on the labor code prohibiting dismissal of a female employee on the ground of pregnancy. Employees who are validly terminated because of illness are entitled to separation pay of at least one month salary or one half month salary for every year of service, whichever is greater.